In Pit Lane is proudly brought to you by Dino Tech by Dino Dynamics. For your nearest workshop, visit our website. And with the support of the Ramada Resort, Phillip Island. When legendary American sports car designer Carroll Shelby first designed the Daytona Coupe back in 1965, he would have never imagined that it could one day end up looking like this. This Daytona Coupe is designed and built right here in Victoria by Richard Bendel, the man behind the famous Motec brand. The original Daytona Coupe was designed by Shelby to take on the might of Ferrari at Le Mans, but it never featured any of the wild-looking wings and underbody aerodynamics featured in this 21st century reinterpretation. Yeah, the aerodynamics at this level of sports car racing, it's just so important. The difference between being 10th and 11th and up the front is all about aero. So we've put some aerodynamic aids on it, which has helped increase the corner speeds, and that's brought seconds out of our lap time. We also went to a wind tunnel to do a little bit more testing. And in the wind tunnel, we're able to find out just how much of a benefit some of these things have been. In fact, at Bathurst last year, we had the front wheels coming off the ground at 240 k's an hour up Conrad, uh, up Mountain Straight. And then this year, when we went back there, the new aerodynamics have kept the front wheels on the ground, which is, makes it far less scary to drive. Carol Shelby was, of course, synonymous with Ford. But the motivation of this local version is 100% pure GM. The part of the problems with the old Ford cars was that the engines were not going to be legally able to be road registered for emissions reasons. So we had to get an engine that could be legally registered and none of the Fords would fit in the engine bay. So Richard had to get a smaller, lighter engine and the LS being an, an alloy engine and being big in capacity it was the perfect solution. So it's a bit of a GM Ford combination. The car's a top 10 runner in the Victorian State Circuit Racing Championships where it takes on the might of the high-tech, high-price factory GT3 thoroughbreds from Ferrari, Porsche, Lamborghini and Dodge. But the local car more than holds its own. I don't think many people expect to see a car so far up the field that's made in limited production as it is. But, you know, the car's done really well and Richard does an excellent job in preparing the car along with Charlie and the other boys. So it's one of those things that you do the right job, you build a car properly and you can compete with the international competitors. The Daytona has been accepted to run in the Invitational class at next February's Bathurst 12-hour race, taking on teams from Europe and Asia as well as some of Australia's best. It might not be the fastest car out there, but rest assured, it'll no doubt be one of the most popular. Why should you get your car tuned with a Dynotech Dyno? Your car will be more fuel efficient. An accurate tune means saving money at the pump. Your car is safe. It never has to leave the workshop to be tested. Increased performance, optimised fuel consumption and more power. Reduced emissions, protect the environment by minimising your carbon footprint. To find your nearest Dynotech workshop, go to www.dyno.com.au. Dynotech by Dynodynamics.